Alright, what's up guys? Best of Games here, and I'm coming at you with some Reno Nazoth Rogue. Um, yeah, this one's an interesting one. I'm not sure how it's going to work yet. I haven't even tested it. But, uh, well, <laughs> I'm coming off of an amazing game that I actually got some, some kid to, like, add me and be really, really angry with me. Because he basically had the game won, and, well... I decided as a last second fuck you, I was gonna play Yax Run. And uh well, I basically won the game from playing Yax Run. So he was a very unhappy person. Because Yax Run basically allowed me to win the game when I really shouldn't have. And I'm aware of this, but I was I was in praise mode. Praise Yog, by the way. Um Yax Run is the best card in this fucking set. Like, it's the worst card, but it's the best card in this fucking set. Like, at the same time. It's incredible. Um... Eh, I'm not gonna coin. I might need it as a combo starter or something. So, this is Reno Nazoth slash fucking everything rogue. Like, it's got this little fucking guy in it. For no real good reason, other than the fact that I just... I felt like I could just throw him in there. Like, he'd, he would do some sort of... valuable work. I don't really care, you can draw two cards. Enjoy. Enjoy your two cards. Buy one! Buy one! Hmm. Get a three drop. What are we gonna get? Um, I mean that's the best three drop there, so let's do it. You can have your two cards. I don't really care. Trust me, if this comes down to control, a I will maybe win. B. Oh, inspire. Give your weapon plus one. That's useful. Actually. Um, do I do this? No, I'll do this. You're not that shy. There you go. There's two two threes to deal with, and you kill one, and you get a one a uh, two one to deal with. That's the biggest tempo play I can make. This is probably one of the good warrior cards that I could have gotten, like one of the better ones. Wait, that comes from his deck, doesn't it? Interesting. 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 <laughs> so we're gonna prep and we're gonna play Thistle T. And oh my god, I got three saps. Suck it. Suck my ass, kid. Three saps. Suck it. Oh my god, that was so beautiful. That was that was actually beautiful. Now he knows I have two more saps. You have an axe grind, don't you? That's cool. I have zero fucks to give. Ooh. Okay then. S suck on this, boy. And I get a weapon. Ooh. Ooh. Burgle. Best card. Cthulhu. Cthulhu. Lost. Ooh, an eviscerate. That's nice. Very nice. Hmm, nice. Mm 
think I'll just do this for this turn. It's okay. He can do the upgrade. I don't really care. All I know is I have to save Sylvanas for turn 9. When he can drop Cthune. Cthune does blah blah blah. Okay. So. I guess the best play, technically speaking, is probably doing this. Seeing where that goes. It went face. Literally pretty much the worst place it could have went. But that's okay. Because we can do this. And then we can eviscerate that. I still have two saps. Do you hear its call? Do you hear its call? Slam. Okay. Ooh, Shadow Strike. So you can Shadow Strike. Sylvanas. The order doesn't matter. Drop Cthulhu now. Boy. Boy, drop Cthulhu. Drop it. Drop a Cthulhu this turn, buddy. He's like, oh, what do I do? What do you do? You gore howl it? Okay. That's a play. Now I have to live in a world where he doesn't have Cthulhu in his hand. Because what's Cthulhu up to at this point anyway? 14-14. Okay, so I'm not technically dead. I mean, I might as well be, but... Thank you. I don't want to play Nazoth just yet. I mean, if he has Cthulhu in his hand, there's a very good chance that he just wins the game here. Like, even minus doing that, like, there's still a pretty good chance he just wins the game. Like I said, if he has Cthulhu in his hand, he wins the game. That hasn't changed. If I can get two Sylvanases to die before he plays Cthulhu, I will be in an incredible spot. But... If he draws Cthulhu, he wins. That's just the bottom line. I have to draw, basically, Reno Jackson next turn. Well, I don't have to draw Reno Jackson just yet. He doesn't have exact lethal. He's got... Four. He's got 11 damage. So he doesn't win the game just yet. But again, a Cthulhu will basically seal him the victory. All he has to do is attack first and then play Cthulhu. 
Uh, he was hoping for something better. Uh, it wasn't something better, that was actually technically worse. Uh, don't have damage to go to my face. Yeah, cool. Cool. Um, the only problem here is that I don't have any way to... Win from here? Is there a problem? Let none survive. I mean, that was great. Okay. See, if I had... Instead of this Nazoth here, if I had Reno Jackson, I could have maybe mounted a comeback there. But, alas, no Reno. So. I don't know if there's enough draw power in this deck. I mean, there's Sprint. There's Sprint and Thistle T, which Thistle T was actually really useful in the game. Because I got all those saps, but other than that, like ah, oh, Reno Jackson, I will take you in my opening hand, please. Although against a priest, I maybe don't need it, but it's still good to have it. It's still good to have a card that can save my freaking bacon as a card in my hand. This is the most important card in the deck. Basically, you play Reno deck, you mulligan for Reno. I, I mean, in a matter of speaking, like, that's what you do. Ah, right, cool. Death Rope card. Mm, they all kind of suck. I'll take a Tomb Pillager. So I have a 2, 3, and 4. Alright, that's not bad. I can work off that. I mean, if he plays Northshire, this is gonna suck for me, but... Coin? What the hell are you playing? Are you my master? Oh, you're a Cthune. Okay. Hmm. I mean, all those choices really sucked. All of them sucked. Like, just straight up bad. Oh, look, it's got Taunt. Isn't that cute? Uh, I mean, this has the best damage output, so I guess I'll play that. Yeah, I expected this much. Got to even have a turn five play. I kind of threw this guy in here because I wasn't sure if he was gonna work. I think he's probably gonna defer a lot of damage away from him, which is a okay with me. I mean, he basically has to deal with that threat or it's going to start hurting him really bad. I also have Reno Jackson in my hand, so I can heal back up when needed. Or when I feel threatened. See, like I said, he's gotta, he's gotta deal with that. It's a threat. It's a problem. He's healing that? Wow, he really wanted that draw that bad. Careful. I gotta get the most damage off the board as possible. Hmm. This will give me the best board possible. Two, three, three, four. Both become two ones when they die. I could work off that. 
You actually gonna trade, or are you just gonna... Okay, you're gonna start painting my stuff. I don't care if you draw through your whole damn deck. Like, that really doesn't matter to me. Is injured? Oh, misplay. You should've drawn more cards. Nub. Okay. That's fine. I mean, yeah, he has something to heal. That's fine. I don't... I don't care. He can't actually deal with the board that I have without another card in his hand. Without, like, a Holy Nova. Ah. That card's a little scary. Yeah, that card's a little scary. I will admit. Give me something good. Mm -mm. Well played. Same well played for. Yes, show respect. I don't think you can kill me next turn. I'm gonna live in a world where you can't. I don't think that's gonna kill me. I think you're gonna come really close, but you're not actually gonna kill me. Here's where I shit on your sandwich, kid. Technically, I just missed. Yes, mistakes were made. You say well played like you're gonna win, but the feast of souls begins now. I was gonna say you're gonna remove the one thing off my board, right? Because you kinda have to. Still don't have the win. It's only a twenty-four. Okay. I win. I'm alive with one. Yeah. Okay. So prep. Viscerate. 
Yaxaron, motherfucker. Let's go. I just got a Cthune. Astral Communion. Confuse. Mark of the Wild. No! There you go. Have at it. You get that one. <laughs> yeah, I committed suicide. Alright, hold on. Do I still need to complete this challenge? Yeah, I do. I know I can complete this challenge with this deck. Come on. Give me one good game. Mm. Yeah, we've been going for 20, 21 minutes now. Let me put it to you this way. If I don't win this game, this game, this video is not even going up. Let's, let's just be real. Except I probably will, because it's still good stuff. Like, it's not bad. Uh, I have the Shadow Step for the Yogg, and that's about it. And also, it doesn't help me in the beginning of the game. I need my prep if I'm going to have a sprint in my hand. Huge Toad. Why did I put a Huge Toad in the snack? Oh, because I needed just more early game. Let's see if I can get some uh, coins early on in this game. He's like, what? Nobody does that. Nobody plays Cut Purse. What are you doing? Is he attacking me? What are you doing? Aggressive much? I think Gang Up is such a cool card. It's terrible, but it's such a cool card. Uh, this will give me something to play him for. That's not a taunt. It's also just a good card. You attack that, and then what? Tag her up again. You're a strange one. You know what? I think I am going to play that. Just because it's technically a better play. The damage that he inflicted upon himself. Now he can't even do it easily. Now he's got a fan of knives or something. Which he probably has. And that's okay. Point what? Oh, well, okay. Well, I mean, if you're gonna do that, then why the hell did you... Yeah, never mind. I'll probably force the sand a little bit. There we go. Second Dark Iron Skulker. Just go and face. Okay. This is the place. Except I'm playing in a world where I'm actually being cautious. Earth Raptor is still a really good card. Like, I like that card a lot. Okay. Fan of Knives. Okay.
I'll just do that. Okay. I'm not sure what his deck's trying to do. Like, it confuses me a little bit. Backstab trade. Backstab SI. Okay. I can Reno Jackson a fuck ton of times. That's kind of fun. I guess we'll just thistle T. Oh! 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 Okay then. We're gonna gang up that. Because we can. I can Reno Jackson a fuck ton of times. This is actually fun. I have Shadow Step for Reno Jackson. I have this Blood Thistle Toxin for Reno Jackson. Oh man. This is actually pretty cool. This is gonna be a cool game. But I'm probably gonna win. Just by default. Because of what I have in my hand. First of all, we're going to do this. I'm going to do this early. Gang up. God damn it. I'm so dumb. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so dumb. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so dumb. Guys, guys, I'm so dumb. I can read them now. <laughs> Get some incredible luck. <laughs> He's like, wait, what? <laughs> oh my god, my incredible dumbass luck. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> oh my god. The fact that that still even worked because I'm so stupid is incredible. <sighs> oh man. If I win now, uh, you know what? Nah, it doesn't even matter. This is going up. It has to. It it physically has to. Like, there's no... <laughs> I had no business even... Is there anything that I can burgle that'll save me? Let's see, he's got 7, 10, um, 12, 14, 16. Chances are he has more damage. Let's just be real here. Um, so let's burgle. Oh, betrayal. Okay, betrayal's good. Um, we can betrayal... Right here. Because it allows me to do this. Which then allows me to play Reno one more time. And then, we're gonna give him stealth, because we can. And then I'm gonna end my turn. So now, he still can't kill me. I have a second Burgle, because I got it from Burgle. Which hopefully will give me a Shadow Step, which means I can Reno again. I hope you're all following this. This insanity. That is literally what I'm doing. Because it's insane. 
and it shouldn't work ever just mindlessly throwing it out there like this should not work there's no reason that I'm even still playing this match because I fucked up I fucked up and the fact that the first two cards after I did gang up was exactly what I was looking for um, okay so first of all we can hit this we can now dagger up we can hit this we can eviscerate that we can play this patient assassin and now he's got 11 wait I can't add he's got 11 11 damage okay so now we live in a world where he can kill me again like as, he, as he's doing Oh my god, I can't believe that I renoed on... I didn't even look at the color of it. I was just like, oh, I can reno, because this is a reno deck. <laughs> Cult Apocathery would be a really good card right now. Right about this time. Um, so... All I'm going to do is I'm just going to do this. And then I'm going to play this middle Nazoth, because I can. And... Oh, look, I have a taunt. I forgot I had a taunt, Nazoth. Um, but that won't be enough to save me, so well played, and... Whew. Oh, man. That was, a, that was some bad moves, man. The fact that I even almost came back from that is a little sad. I'm just going to concede, because there's, there's no point to the rest of this game. Um, holy crap, that was just comically bad. Like, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna watch this game and I'm just gonna be insulted by myself, but, like, by my own lack of paying attention. Because I'm just commentating, I'm just talking instead of actually paying attention to the game. Wow, that was... Oh, that was just terrible. <laughs> and the fact that I almost made up for it is the even more terrible part. Wow, okay. Um, yeah, that's it, guys. Best of games. This is definitely going up now just because of that last game. Peace out.